Kim Kardashian reveals pregnant Kourtney Kardashian is on bed rest as she misses family birthday gathering. Kim Kardashian shared her plans for quality time with Kourtney Kardashian Barker as she awaits baby number four. Kourtney Kardashian Barker has her family by her side through the last stretch of her pregnancy. Hello. If you're new here please do not forget to subscribe, like and hit the notification bell to remain updated. Over the weekend, the pregnant Lemmy founder, 44, received a shout-out from sister Kim Kardashian as she thanked her sisters and friends for celebrating her birthday. Kim shared a group photo of her posing with sisters Chloe, Kendall, and Kylie Jenner and mom Kris Jenner at her birthday party at Funk Restaurant in Beverly Hills on Friday. So blessed to have hit the jackpot of friends. I couldn't have ever dreamed I would be so lucky to call these girls my friends sparkles thank you for all the birthday love red heart, she began. Referencing her missing sister, she added, Court I'm jumping in bed with you next week for our bed rest picnic. Kourtney Kardashian jokes about feud with sister Kim as she celebrates her birthday, people think the fights they see on TV are bad on Saturday, the push founder spoke about the various feuds she's had with Kim over the years in a birthday tribute to the star, who turned 43, as an ongoing feud with Kim on the latest season of the Kardashians has played out. Happy happy birthday to my first sister, Courtney wrote as she posted a throwback photo of herself and Kim on her Instagram story. Thank you for all those years of bossing you around and you actually listening to all of my crazy ideas. People think the fights they've seen on TV are bad if only they got to witness the hair pulling, nail digging ones from early high school, she continued. The joys of sisterhood, Courtney jokingly added. I love you deeply forever and always. May God bless this year with love and happiness and abundant joy red heart. Their fighting began after the pair got into an argument over edits seen from the previous season of the show, relating to their feud over Kim's partnership with Dolce & Gabbana after they designed Courtney's wedding dress. In an interview with Vogue for their November issue, Courtney, who was expecting her fourth baby, her first with husband Travis Barker, reflected on the urgent fetal surgery she received in September. That experience opened my eyes to a whole new world of pregnancy that I didn't know about in the past, she told the outlet. It was terrifying. And I learned that insurance typically only covers two ultrasounds when you're pregnant, I had no idea, she continued. I've always been lucky enough to do more than what insurance covers, and it's one of those ultrasounds that saved my baby's life, in a confessional with Kim, who agreed. Yeah, that's the feeling, helpless. It's all these years later he feels so strongly about Courtney, she said. They're both really elusive, so Scott has to grow some balls and stop just talking to us about these things and let's just talk to Court about it, Chloe concluded. Let's see how she feels you never know unless you bring it up. During a group dinner, Kim then decided to facilitate a conversation about Courtney and Scott getting back together, beginning by suggesting they just skip to the wedding. Scott made it clear that he would marry her right here, right now, but Courtney wasn't having it. I'm feeling really ambushed right now like, I don't know, I'm usually more prepared to talk to the family and so I don't even know how to react, she told the cameras. Scott and I have had these talks before so I just think that him and I have our own, like, private understanding of like, what would even need to happen for that to even be a consideration, and I just don't really think it's fair to like, talk about it in front of the whole family as if it's everyone's business. I don't know what all the limbo is for, Scott said in his own confessional. There was a time when the whole family would tell Courtney, the last person you want to be with is Scott. Now, the whole family wants us back together.